Welcome back to Elden Ring. We're going to see if we can get up here to this very, very high place by going under into a poison swamp, apparently. If I'm on Torin, will that protect me? Oh, yeah, I put on the red cape, by the way. Just wanted to try it. It looks terrible with my shield on my back because it just clips through it horribly, but it looks fine when I'm off, off the horse. Good, I don't take poison. Thank you, Torrent. Apparently, Torrent's immune to poison. The Great Glintstone Shard, it's so powerful. Oh my god, there's so many rotting bodies just hanging. That in the mist is disturbing. Hell of a set piece, though. I think out there will probably lead to here. That's another entrance to the down below area. I guess let's go check it out just in case there's something here. No, it really doesn't look like anything. I don't know why I'm gathering... Oh, Village of the Albanorix. I don't know why I'm gathering Roa fruit like I don't have 300 of it. They're crying. Maybe that was a family member up there. Are you going to attack me? Yeah. Oh my god, their limbs are so long. And it's like their legs have rotted away. Ugh. Oh, this is a huge pile of bodies that I'm walking on, I just realized. Wishy, you. Wait, that's. Uh, I forgot their name, but we met them a couple times before, right? Oh, it's you. Yeah. Well, what do you make of it? What's happened to this village? I witnessed a sight much the same in my infancy the oppression of the weak. Murder and pillage unchecked. A waking nightmare made by men. But this time, I'm a woman grown. And though the suffering cannot be undone, I can still mete out justice. Justice to the oppressors. Let the scars I carve remind them. I am Nefeli Lu, warrior. But this time, and though the justice to the oppressors, so glad we get to see him again. Probably going to see them further in this village, I would assume.
Wow, what a cool spell. Larval Tear. What was that used for again? I think that was used for resetting your character. Which is done at Renala. Hello. This village is done for. Please, even if it's just you, old Albus, hide well and still your breath. Visions of Sorcerer. What is this location called? Village of the Albanurix. So I can go further up or across the bridge. The bridge looks like a dead end, so let's go here first. Precious item ahead. Visions of snake. Oh! Oh, 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 I just realized what that's a reference to. Visions of snake. This reminds me of Sekiro. Why is there a tumbleweed here? Didn't expect a bridge. Visions of snake. Therefore, try left. Well, that's not gonna reach. Behold, crab! That's a good one. Armament ahead. What are you? Whispering. Oh, they're just like the others, really. They're just a sorcerer. <gasps> that sounds like a mage weapon. It is. It scales pretty poorly with everything, but it's unupgraded, so it might get better. It does physical and magic damage. Standard slash pierce, straight sword. Sword fashioned from pure crystal, a deed impossible for a human. Enwreathed with powerful magic, its attack scales with intelligence. The inscrutable crystal. Stallions have but one clear purpose, to safeguard their crystals unto the end. One theory posits that they yearn for the return of their creator who will carve for them new brethren. Oh, that's pretty. I mean, that's a mage weapon, right? It's blue. If only I had a light for that herba. 
Oh yeah, we have those new mixing ingredients for the Flask of Wondrous Physic. Um, so we have this one, restores half of total FP in mixed physic, and then ruptured crystal tear causes concoction to explode in mixed physic. I don't see why that would be a good thing. Causes an explosion. And restores half of total FP? Let's see how that is. Yeah, that didn't feel too good. Does that hurt enemies, though? Like, is it at least good for that? Oh, hang on. Before I go die, I should probably level up. I think I have like 20,000 runes. 22,000. <laughs> what do I want more of? Everything. Hmm. Haven't done Vigor in a while. More health would be nice. But instead, I'm going to do Int. Okay, it does do damage in a very small radius around you. I didn't see how much, though. One more time. Let's try to see how much. A uh, thousand and five. That is a lot of damage, but is it really worth hurting yourself and you only get one use? Let's make a concoction that restores HP and restores FP. So kind of my backup in case I run out. I don't think I actually want to be on a horse here. Try jump attack. What is that? They could be real nasty or they might just be a normal mob. I can't tell. It's so freaking dark here. Whoa. What is... Oh, it's like fire powder. You know, before I do anything else, I have an extra slot for a spell. Let's get a light. That's not the right one. with the light over here. I'm suspicious about that pot. Too high up, yeah. Wait, what? Where did I get that from? Ivory Sickle. It's a dagger. Sickle fashioned from ivory. Weapon carried by aged Albinorix. These weapons are evidence of their dedication to the Halic Tree, despite never having entered its presence. does physical and magic. Scales with strength, dex, and int. 
It's an interesting little weapon. Very fast, as you'd expect. Ugh, slow rolling. Dare I crack it? Please no, dear me. You okay? I haven't a clue. No secrets lie with me, not a one. Oh, please leave me be. Wait then, you're not one of them. Well, what a relief. <laughs> oh, goodness me, I. I'm Alvus, and Alvinoric, as you can see, we're finished. The whole village is finished. The curse mongers have destroyed everything. No one that remains has their wits about them, I beg you. Would you look after this medallion? You must keep it out of the curse mongers' hands. Halectree's secret medallion, right. It's a key item. And if you should meet the young Albinorek Latena, then please give it to her. A chosen land awaits us, Albinoreks. The medallion is the key that leads to the city. It's only a quaint treasure for we who cannot make the journey. But for dear Latena, it is needed to fulfill her purpose. My legs will soon fade, and with them my life. Alas, this is the immovable fate of all Albinorex. <laughs> Are they about to die? There's a lot of blood. Oh no! Aww. Time for rolling, and then visions of friend. Try attacking? I suppose that might work as well, but... No, let's not upvote that. You should roll, don't hit him. Visions of boss. So to speak, let there be vengeance. Oh, wait, does that say vengeance? No, vigilance. Sorcery ahead. Thanks for letting me know. Oh, hi! Oh, that's creepy as fuck. That's scurrying. Boss ahead. I don't really have a reason to kill that. I mean, I guess? I guess I don't really have a reason not to? Well, it's a waste of FP. I guess that's a reason. Weak foe ahead. By the way, be wary of pack. Try down. Uh, no thank you. Oh, dog. Time for sniping spot. Dog and then time for boss. I don't think I can reach you. No. Do any of these other things reach further? How about you? Dang. How about star shower? Nope. Omen killer. Ah, what the fuck? Where did you come from? Chill. Wow, they're cool looking. 
Why do they take a lot of damage from this? Or they just don't have much health, I guess. Omen Killer is such a cool name. Crucible Not Talisman. Reduces damage and impact of headshots. A talisman fashioned from a bony knot that embodies the aspects of various creatures. Said to have grown on the human body long ago. A vestige of the crucible of primordial life, born partially of devolution, it was considered a signifier of the divine in ancient times, but is now increasingly disdained as an impurity as civilization has advanced. Reduces damage and impact of headshots taken. How often do enemies get headshots on me? Pretty rarely. that that counterattack just rarely hits them. Seek coffin. Precious item ahead. Oh, I see it. No clear sky. If only I had a monster, Pickle. If only you had a gigantic rectangular shaped dick. That does seem to be a dead end down there, so... Yeah, there must be a teleporter or something that will take you over there. Let's explore this other bit of land going on the other side of Lake Liernia. Let's start from the very bottom. Let's take some cotton first, though. I think I'll survive. Yes. Ah. Oh, hi. Oh, right, it's just these weaklings. I guess I should kill them in case one of them, I don't know, turns into a bear. This is a great opportunity to use Magic Limp Blade. Ow! Oh no. No, I'm mispressing all the keys. 
Oh, oh no. Oh, they got free from that carriage over there. I guess they got free and they killed all these people, right? Since they are the giant's captors. Good for you. Unfortunately, I am probably going to kill you unless you don't attack me. Do you attack me? Because if you don't... Okay, they're angry. Time for sleep. Tree spear. Gorgeous view. Necessary item ahead. Uh... No. No edge ahead. In short, don't you dare. Oh yeah, tree spear. It's a great spear. Takes 15 strength, 22 dex, and 18 faith. It's a faith weapon. Does holy damage. Golden spear with tree-like design. Wielded by knights employed as palace guards in the royal capital of Lindell. Deals holy damage. Requiring superior dex. Superior dexterity to wield, this great spear can perform consecutive thrust attacks despite its larger size. What are you? Is that an enemy? Oh, it's a dog! Sorry, honey. Oh, that wasn't even a dog! That was just wildlife! I'm sorry! Thank you for your thin bones.
Ooh, there's a lot of them. Hello? Oh, you're an enemy. Thought that was an NPC. It's not bothering me. I'll leave it. That's a new crafting ingredient. Have we been there? No, we have not. Almost looked like it could be in the swamp, but it's not quite in the swamp. Purified ruins. Ooh, I thought I saw something below there. 
I found that without any messages. I'm proud of myself. Try down. No mimicry ahead, but liar ahead. Be wary of decoy. Don't you dare. Is it a teleporting one? It's fine. Two fingers heirloom. Wait, what exactly is that? Is that a talisman? Yeah. Raises faith. Raises it by five. A talisman engraved with the legend of the two fingers. Raises faith. Fingers cannot speak, yet these were eloquent. Persistently did they wriggle, spelling out mysteries in the air. Thus did we gain the words, the words of our faith. <laughs> I love that. Persistently did they wriggle, spelling out mysteries in the air. Creepy bastards. Love them. Come out, one and all, from the darkness underground, and let us offer unto the maiden our eyes. Some other small runes around here. Runes? No, ruins. Seek fruit. They point over here. Hmm. Not sure what they're talking about. Maybe I already picked it up and didn't realize it. Hey, the Shibiri uh, grape person. I have some more for you. Hello. Is Would you donate any Shibiri grapes in your possession to me? I'm on a pilgrimage, and when I eat one of those, mm -hmm. of course. You're not like the others who give me grapes, are you? They rest their trembling hands upon me, yeah. howling wordlessly. They gently stroke my eyes, their frail fingers emaciated yet still they give me the grapes but you seem somehow firmer yeah my flesh isn't rotting i'm a bit firm you are most kind indeed may the blessing of the fingers be upon you so i guess we keep meeting them at like on their journey every once in a while and have to give them more grapes for them to continue. Wonder where I'll see him next. Yay, five mushrooms. <gasps> Ooh. Magic butthole. <laughs> Fuck off. First off, Grace, and then time for Sending Gate. Oh, there's a Grace. Ah, 
Ah, yes, there is. See, that's a great message. It's kind of pointed across the way at this. Is that how I get up there? Please let it be how I get up there. I have a really good feeling about this. <laughs> no, that's not what I wanted. Wait, no, that's not where I was. Here. Liernia Highway North. Ah, gotta keep looking. This is a battlefield. Oh, there's a battle happening right now. Between whom? Between some spirits and the normal soldiers. What are those spirits? And what were these things? Giant ahead. Oh, that's... Oh, that's an old rusted body of one of the marionettes. A bunch of the marionettes are all over the place. Whoa, that's a lot of spirits. How easy are they to kill? Well, just one. One hit. No, no, don't. Don't do that. Get off. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm out of here. Coming for me, come on. I should do it. Lucerne. Oh, this is the lower pathway. The upper pathway will continue on north, but this way leads to this crumbled bridge that leads to the Academy Gate Town. I think that up there will also lead up and over to the other side. Did 
dashing through a head and then tower. Ah! I see. Don't you dare. Don't worry, I saw the chest. Ooh, a new staff! Carrion Glintblade staff! Elden Ring. Beautiful. It is a very pretty game. New cookbook. Anything stand out to me? Albanuric pot might be new. Freeze and grease might be new. sound they make when they're defeated is very satisfying. Okay, let's take a look at that staff. Ooh, the passive effect is boosts glint blade sorcery. This goes with strength, dex, and int, of course. And its starting sorcery scaling is a 134. I actually can't really compare that to anything. I mean, these all start... Like, this one starts with 60 for some weird reason. So I don't really get how sorcery scaling works. It sounds nice. Staff embedded with a blue glintstone, one of two types of carrion staff. Gifted to enchanted knights, it enhances glintblade sorceries. Well, glintblade is, like, my mainstay damage-dealing stuff. Glintstone shard... Are any other glintstone? Like magic glint blade, I guess, would be one. The others, I'm not sure, but just the shard is the most important one, really. Yeah, I'll see how much I can upgrade it when we get back to the round table hold. Oh my, this is kind of dangerous. Whew. I don't want to go kill a bunch of puppers. Do I want to head down over to the bridge? I guess I do, huh? There could be something there. Oh, wow. I think that would have killed me. Thought I saw a message. Ah! 
Oh. Boom. Didn't expect explosion. Same. Oh, it's a bear. Like, a normal bear. With some gold-tinged excrement over here, too. Does that mean the bear's been eating gold? Sorry, big boy. Hefty beast bone. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I think uh, Magic Glint Blade would be good for this. Maybe. M maybe, maybe not. God, this thing terrifies me. Uh. Okay. Okay. I fought this melee before I can do it again. See, I fought it before. I can do it again. Just gotta believe in yourself. Hefty beast bone, beast blood, and gold tinged excrement. Bears are eating gold, apparently. Ooh, there's someone to speak with over there. I should level up also. Should I pause on Int and get something else for once? Let's get more health. Oh, it's the grape person. Do I have more grapes? Hello? Would you donate him on a pilgrim when I eat one? Do I have any? Oh. Uh, I do. Now I can feel the distance at a side. I wonder what Shabriri grapes really are. That's what I'm wondering. Actively tender and sweet, yet searing. What a sight they must be to behold. I can say that they're human eyes? Wait, I'm sorry. I never looked at the description for them. Are they actually human eyes? What the fuck? Um... <laughs> um, uh, uh, don't, don't say anything. I wonder, delectably, what a sight. Do I have to say something? Do I have any more? Because I want to look at a description. Oh my god. I don't have any in my inventory, but I just looked it up on the wiki just to look at the description there, and holy fuck, they are human eyeballs. <laughs> A yellowing, oozing eyeball of the infirm. The surface is shriveled, and the inside is squishy, not unlike a large, overly ripe grape. Give to the blind maiden to guide her to the distant light. Wow. I wish I'd read that before, or maybe I don't. I don't know. The question is, do I tell them? I'm really curious what the reaction would be. Uh, do these say anything? Suffering required ahead. Okay, so you do need to tell them? Try west. Likely... Dung butt head. What? S 
suffering required ahead. I think that means I need to tell them. What a sight they must be to Bob. They're human eyes. No. That's not possible. Not all of those people. Their own. So those noises I heard were. <laughs> oh no. S sorry. I'm all right now. Don't mind me. Mm. I apologize. You only did as I asked. I'll be fine. Think no more of it. Will you be fine though? I apologize. I'll be fine. God, I hope that was okay. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I would throw up too. You still okay? I apologize. I'll be fine. Okay. Ugh, I hope I made things better in the long run, at least. That leads up. Hey, puppers. What the heck? A ghostly ferryman? Are you an enemy? God, he looks so cool. Oh, they are an enemy. That is so cool. It looks like what they're using as a paddle is actually a great horn. Oh. Uh, to be a mariner. Uh... Hello? Oh no. Where did they go? Oh. <laughs> what a cool boss. Just the concept so far is really cool. Death root. Skeletal bandit ashes. That was a very easy boss, but such a cool concept. Ashes. It's a key item. Oh, it's my second one. Beast clergyman seeks and devours these. All right. For the beast clergy thing, we have to go to this, right? This mark, the sending gate. Try night. 
Ooh. Let's see if I can find a nearby site of grace. There's a pathway that leads there. Oh yeah, from the eastern Liurnia Lake shore that we found when we were exploring Liurnia. Definitely not going to survive that. Oh, you can take tombstones down, actually. Try down. That's alright, we'll come back there later. Well, I'll put a mark there. Because it doesn't actually look like there's anything there on the map. It doesn't show a village, but there is. required ahead. This guy? Despite the fact that that's hitting them in the back, it didn't do much damage. That's better. Yeah, like 57. It's acting as if I hit him in the front. Right? If I hit him in the front, what does it do? 190. I, I don't get it. Dragon Cult Prayer Book. <laughs> Item ahead, but dung. Yeah. <laughs> Not a great one, but it does allow me to make um, poison boluses. So, I don't think it's actually crap. Sorry, doggies. Didn't mean to wake them from their slumber. Night ahead, so to speak, incantation ahead. Oh, I guess that's if you came at that guy from the other side. Strong foe ahead. Ooh, another painting. Artist's Shack. Resurrection Painting. Hmm. Was that made just right next to us? Because it shows a graveyard. I think so, yeah. Because there's the Erd Tree and there's... The castle that it was a painting of. Let's make it nighttime and go back there. To where the Mariner was. I wonder if the Mariner was a thing that only appears at nighttime, and maybe it was nighttime before? I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe it was nighttime before. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when we return, we're gonna head from 
eastern Liernia Lake shore and discover what's down here in this little lower village before we continue up north. <laughs> 